I love this little path and one of the reasons is we can spy on other people's garden and gardens and see what they're growing there and yeah, get some ideas. These plants, they grow so good here. I don't know what they are. These like cabbage looking plants. And I love the wall. The moss on it, it's so pretty. I have just noticed this beautiful tree. Full of delicious persimmons. Mm. Also love this iron work. So pretty with the flowers. And you? Do you like it, Cherry? <laughs> and all the little steps. Because right now we are thinking on the flooring on the terrace. And I love both the flagstone and the little stones. This garden is so beautiful. A boy with a swan or a goose. So pretty. I have just noticed this rose. It's, yeah, I've seen it with little, little blooms during the summer, but all this hedge was overgrown and now they're cleared. And look at the stem of this rose. It's like, I've never seen rose with such a huge stem. It's like 50 years old, maybe. Look at this branch. Wow. It's huge! in last two years. These mushrooms are very beautiful, to be honest. I'm not sure if they are edible. The swan went to the place where we were before to check if there is any food left. They are very clever creatures. Look at him. Oh, oh, he's so beautiful. Ah. Wow, Sherry, no. You're very naughty. Sherry, no. Oh, Kotik, you're really naughty. Oh, I don't know. Oh, oh, you're okay. Take two. Oh, he's very beautiful. Sorry, I know they're very silly, those two. 
I know. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Come here. Okay, I need to talk to you. That was really naughty. Mm-hmm. And now you're happy. I can see your happy smile. Happy, naughty smile. Mm-hmm. <laughs> now I'm stopping by every stone wall to see how it's been made. This one, and then there is this little one. <laughs> oh. Sherry, what's in your mouth? Is it stone for the wall? Sherry, show me, show me the stone. Sherry, stop, stop. What's in your mouth? Show me. Is it for the wall? <laughs> yes, definitely. This one is really beautiful with the moss. But this one is not a dry wall. It has concrete in between. The creeping fig. This is the one I have. Actually, it was stolen here. <laughs> I'm still in little cuttings and rooting them. But look how beautiful and thick it is. Uh, this is the one I planted by the front, by the front porch. Beautiful. And then another stone wall. This one is a dry wall. Ta da! I'm at the house. The weather is beautiful. I had very good rest back at home lazy morning and i'm here in a garden today continuing with digging <laughs> excavating the a huge stone which i found and i couldn't um, dig out yesterday so the project for today is to excavate the, the rock and to do a little bit more of digging yeah but the terrace looks it looks really nice I really love it. It's a little bit wonky. <laughs> it's fine. Ah, oh, what a beautiful day. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> I've been filming and then I realized that I haven't even said hello. I'm, I'm at the garden and I will be working two, maximum three hours today. This night I had a nightmare. I arrived at the garden and the wall wasn't here. And there was definitely, there was a person responsible for that. And I was asking, where is the wall? Um, so she had to wake me up because I was talking, I was speaking, I was saying, where is the wall? I was very, very angry. <laughs> uh, yeah. I brought um, my tea with me and uh, what and the most important thing i brought the laundry and the laundry my weekly laundry now looks like that <laughs> oh there is a t-shirt but yeah lots and lots of gloves and now they're nice and fresh so i can choose two of them and start working yay good this is the rock i have to dig out and it is massive this one because it's just the top of the iceberg <laughs> and the bed is ready to lay one more meter of the wall maybe if i dig out this one it might go to the base oh i'm really very pleased with it it feels so good but this is the height I need to achieve more or less. So more two, one or two, two layers more will be good. And one layer is already under the ground. And I'm so happy that 
for this you need just just the sto stone and uh, a lot lot of free time <laughs> so it's basically it can be done by by anyone if you pay enough attention you do research it's not perfect my wall but i can see every single section of the wall with my with the practice it's getting better and i can see the difference which is also i love it to see the progress in every in every project you can see uh, how it started <laughs> the starting point and then the finish point it's also a nice feature so let's start the work It's a huge stone and this is the Badle bush stamp and it was, it was so yeah, people were fighting them because every huge stamp we are, take, we are digging out uh, at some point was just buried under a huge pile of rocks but then it grew anyway, it, it grew through the stones and every time we are digging the Badle stamp we see, we see the image like that, huge stones around, and this one, this one is massive. And as you can see, there was no problem at all for the Bodleia bush to, to grow through this huge, huge stone. Ay, ay, ay. This is unbelievable, because I can move easily now the stone, but not the root. The root is so strong, and the size of it is huge. So the rock now, when I put the thing between two of these things. The, the rock moves easily, but not the root. Ah, I don't like it. Look at this. My favorite thing. This. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh. Oh. this is pure nightmare. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Look how many look how many of them. Mm, delicious, delicious blackberries. How fun it is excavating Badle roots. Pure joy. <laughs> the mandragora root. Get out of there. Oh, honestly. I don't know what is worth. Blackberries or Badle. Get out. Get out. I think I will I will just cut it off. Oh. Okay. Okay. Say goodbye to your home sweet home. Yes. Well done. Look at this beauty. I was so busy digging the soil and yeah once I turned around the sunset is so beautiful
while it is light I I think I'll show you the today's progress because I will be staying here maybe one more hour and it will get dark really soon today's progress looks like that so I have done this trench which is more or less level zero now there I have to dig out a little bit more to put the, uh, the base stones and the slope will be going slightly here and there let's go and have a look to the sunset one more time oh. In winter we don't have sun at all in this garden it's because the sunset is down there but at least on the sunset we have just a little bit of sun here in this corner so it will be nice seating area it's a little bit dark to show you the result today's result but more or less you can see Just until Saturday, we will keep this piece of land high without digging it out um, because we will order another load of stones and we have to make sure they will land <laughs> on a very, very soft pillow of soil. <laughs> This is the most delicious, comforting food for me <laughs> for autumn and winter. Uh, sour cabbage, fermented cabbage, pickles, uh, white beans. I buy it, I think it's um, German or Swiss. German or Swiss, love it. Oh, the dinner will be amazing. Can't wait. And here I have sausage, onions and potatoes. Mm. I think I know how to make it just perfect, this dish. On my balcony there is some fresh parsley. Oh, Sherry, you are being super cute. Super cute. Do you know where the parsley is? Hmm? Do you? <laughs> okay, let's go and find some parsley. Oh, it smells so good outside. Oh. And the fresh parsley is here. I'll grab a good pinch of it. Oh, it's going to be so good. Look at this. Oh, just look at that.
total paid for that and the rest into the pan. It's almost ready, the potatoes. Oh, it is so good. It is so good, so good. I'm starving. <laughs> oh, yummy. This perfection. Oh, let me try it. Oh, I can't, can't wait. Mm -hmm. Oh, it is so good. Bon appetit.